What time frame do you use as a higher time frame bias? So uh, it depends, it depends, it depends, it depends. Um, H, H1 through daily is, is obviously like the range. Um, weekly, barely, but yeah. Why have, why have no, why have no never considered, why have, whoa, why have no never? You mean like why haven't I ever um, considered trading NAS for what? Why would I trade something when I make all the money that I want to on one thing already? It doesn't make sense. I can make all my money plus more on 30. So why go to a period that's still relatively new and then I gotta learn all over again and then risk losing? Nah, I'm good. I'd rather stick with, with what I know to make the kind of money that I know that I could guarantee make um, majority of times and that kind of shit and go from there. Benefits of trading indexes over Forex. Um, Forex I've traded for like around six years, six, seven years. Um, I think it's more just, you know, based on your skill level. You know what I'm saying? Like you pretty much base trade based on your skill level and that kind of thing. So as you get better in trading or more experienced in trading, then you tend to want to trade different assets and that kind of stuff. And then that's when you could dabble in indexes and that kind of stuff. Bro, you need to pull up in Jamaica. I'm in Jamaica very often, honestly. What do I think of the funded trader? Uh, just unfortunate. Are you still using unregulated brokers? Yes, I am. I've been using unregulated brokers for the past nine years. Nine years unregulated. No, no problem with me. Where do you see yourself in 10 years?